She says that the girth doesn't lie and he's lost weight, but I see like more fat on there his belly than was there before. So I'm probably, so it's probably like muscle that she's, it's gotta be muscle. He's gotta have lost muscle because he, I see he's got chub on him still and he's still got booty muscle, I see. Good job, Sophie. Look at, yeah. Yeah. So she already warmed him up and she's going to try and work on getting him to move from behind before they canter because after they canter he gets all anxious and stuff. When I get frustrated, he gets frustrated. Yeah. It does not work well. That's right. That's right, sister. And there's Sam coming. I'm, I, got, I need to bring like a big blanket and... Oh, I feel so good to see you on Chino again. The problem is, is that when she... Yeah, when she doesn't ride him for a while, he's a hard horse to get used to. Yeah, she has to like totally relearn him every single time she's off, even if it's just a week. Everybody needs a Finny in their life. So let's go straight in the middle, sister. There we go, that's better. It's actually doing really well with these pools. He tricked. He did not like holes, does he? No, those holes are too small. Trying to be good Looking so hot Looking so fine Baby, for tonight I want you to be mine We're going for a ride Oh, we're going for a ride So won't you come on out What do you do if he puts it too far behind the vertical? Put your hands forward then. What you gonna say? I just wanna take you far away. Don't go to sleep, staying in bed. Gonna pick you up, so be ready to play. You're looking so hot, looking so fine. Baby, for tonight, I want you to be mine. We're going for a ride. So, we're keeping Chino because, no, whoa, fine. we do not think that she, like we haven't even tapped into Chino's potential yet, but we're figuring out his feet. We just need to get the right kind of shoes. Some people say he's not a competition horse. I think he is a competition horse if we figure him out. Maybe he loves cool shoes, they're going to hot shoes. We're going to figure him out because we're not going to give up on him. But in the meantime, while we're figuring him out, Gabby might pursue some other options. Wow, that's so fancy. So Gabby is pursuing some other options just like because she has an opportunity to ride other horses because we also ride at another barn. So she tried a horse last week that we really like. He's five years old and I think he's a, I think he's our next horse. I think he's her next horse to be honest. He's not perfect, but they got along really well. We're going for a ride. So won't you come on out with me forever young. So she tried one horse, a really gorgeous red-headed boy who's five years old, and tonight she's gonna try a different horse. And this other horse. You almost missed that. This other horse she's riding in a lesson with a little girl, and she's only what flatting him. He's only flat, he's only a flat horse right now. So she's gonna try him, see how she likes him. And he is a gray, you guys, it'll be her first gray. Bounciest horse I've ever ridden. Bounciest horse she's ever ridden. So I have a theory that when he's 
thinner, he doesn't move as well, he doesn't have the same kind of energy. And people might think that's, people might think that that's dumb because he's never really been skinny. He's never really been skinny. I think he's definitely fatter. Most horses do better if they're a little bigger in weight. That was good. It's better with bigger poles, but I forget what the, the gist of the article was about that I read, but it was saying that like horses are, are more energetic if they have a little bit more weight versus if they have a little less weight. Does that make sense? I couldn't hear it. I, I made his brain it, think when I made him walk in frame. Did she make your brain think? He's like, yes, and I hated it. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm going to go the other way. It's a canter Oh, oh, what the heck? Hey, hey. Full on cantering. Me and Brandon. Yeah. On that one. Yeah. When you were, you know, you cantered Storm and I almost ran into Brandon. And he said outside, so I thought he was talking to me. For me to go outside. <laughs> yeah. That's true. That is true. Okay. Let's see what they say. I know we've talked about this before. And, but I never really explained it unless you guys saw the video a long time ago when we first started with Brandon He was a, like the first time we got him as a second coach and he was riding Tex yeah. He was riding Tex in a lesson giving Gabby a lesson. So no, Fiona was giving a lesson. Oh Fiona was giving a lesson anyways, Brandon said outside and Gabby thought like because he's a coach like he was telling her to me he was coaching her, go to the outside. So she went to the outside, and he went to the outside. Pew! Yeah, that happened. So much fun stuff happened back in the day when you guys were younger, and. I hate when that happens. <laughs> my horse, except for when my horse did that. <laughs> this is a nice canter. Falling on his face, he didn't fall. Lean back. He was almost falling on his face. And then he went lame after that. Yeah. But he didn't go lame. So this horse, literally, like a lot of what we see is just over exaggeration. If you don't think your feet, you're going to fall on your face. Right after he said that. Yeah. So, like, literally, when he goes over the poles, if he touches a pole with his foot, he acts like he literally broke his leg. Like, he throws his whole body, like, yes! I, I fall on the pole, whereas other horses, like this horse, <laughs> just goes over. She's getting a little wild. Is she getting a little wild, no. Sophie? No. Drive it in front of you? Sophie and Finn are really getting into it. Like they're really starting to get there. My horse going over those yeah, no. Is he gonna hit them? Okay. I do not want your horse hitting poles. He always hits one pole. Okay. I swear Sophie's like the quietest, calmest kid. Then you put her on a horse and she's like zoom, zoom, zoom. Oh he did it! He did it pretty good. He doesn't ever go over poles that close together that good. You guys be missing Chino? I've been missing Chino. Look at that belly though. I can see if Gabby can see it. I see a belly. See it? Do you see it? You see the little jiggle? So won't you come on out with me? So come on out, yeah. So come on out. Oh, no, 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 no. Close your eyes. Let me show you the best of my world. Hold me tight. The thing about horses for us is that this is like our recess. This is our gym. This is our get out of the house and do stuff. Cold? Or my leg. Why don't you bring your winter boots now? I know. See? No canter poles. There. Do that again. Making memories. Let's do this together. Flying high. Only me. Don't you know that you